I started entertaining with magic with my dad, my mom, my three sisters when I was eight years old. My father had a traveling magic show, and he stressed to me a long time ago, it's not the trick that makes the magician good, it's the presentation. And uh, I think my presentation is totally different than what anybody's doing out there today. Perfect! Turner, she's a little better than you. What's that? Sure. Okay. Uh, but if we count it down, we have one, two, three, four. Now they all say four right now. Ladies and gentlemen, you can do it fast, slow, but you know, sometimes people say, Gail, you move too quick, you talk too fast. Can you slow down? Tonight, Barbara, myself, Gruder, are going to do this in slow motion. Should be pretty easy for you, Gruder. I like to bring the humor back into magic. I try to make myself the joke, not the audience. And so I always tell the audience, I'm not here to make fun of you, I'm here to have fun with you. And a lot of times I'll let the audience win. One lady wrote to me that she enjoyed the show because of my willingness to share the punchlines. And uh, maybe that's my personality, I don't know, but I've always enjoyed that type of humor. Thank you, David, for being a good volunteer. What do you do for a living, David? What do you do? I'm a judge. to ad lib is what makes my show different. Uh, every show actually is different from the one before because I work off the audience. And so that way you can tailor it to who you're working for. What's your last name if you don't mind me asking, Jarvis? Juan. Because oh, I'd like to know. Juan. <laughs> I would like to know. That's why. Oh, it's Jarvis Juan? Juan is the loneliest number. Okay, all right. Jarvis Juan. Let me guess. German name? Okay, I didn't know. Okay, no. Jarvis Wan? 
What town? What town did your ancestors come from? Where did your ancestors come from? From uh, Block. Sure, right by Hamburg. <laughs> Close to Munich. All right, examine this if you would, there, Juan. We have one piece of rope, don't we? It's a long one, isn't it? Is there? I'm going to have you do me a favor. Tie up my thumbs as tight as you like. Harry Houdini could get out of anything. Juan, tie up the thumbs if you would. Really, really tight. So where do you work at, Juan? What do you do for a living? What do you work at? Construction? Where at? Pizza Hut? Okay. <laughs> Personal pan construction. He did good. He tied it up. He tied a couple double knots on both sides. Juan, if you would, I got a little green, a uh, little shower cap in there. Would you grab that green shower cap? And I don't have it in my hand. It's over there. <laughs> place the green shower cap on top. This is what we're going to try to do. Yeah, please. We're going to try to get out of here, okay? Why don't you step over on this side? It'd be a lot easier. That way you'll be able to see a little bit easier. Because I don't want you to miss anything. Okay. We're going to try to get out of here. Everybody try to watch. On the count of three, one, we'll count to three. It goes one, two, three, and then we'll try to get out of here, all right? I don't know, I can't do it. How about a round of applause for one? Sarah, for one! The best response that I could ever get from somebody is that we laugh so hard, the time just flew by. I like to make people laugh. I'll, I'll admit that I'm more of a comedian than I am a magician, even though I come from a magical family. But uh, I really enjoy the humor and being able to make the joke, once again, on myself, not on the audience if I don't have to.